but the reason I went to the non-world title route against Von Farah is that what this fight can lead to basically as much as I would love to be world champion again against Jürgen Bremer and win that world title I chose the Von Farah route because I think win against Von Farah and the doors open then in America which is the big league so I'm looking at the bigger picture I think that opens the doors to a big future in boxing for me um, again beating Bremer and winning the world title would open doors you know that would be a great feat but I just feel Von Farah is you're in the elite level then why is America different? What makes America absolutely like different? Um, America is different. It's it's different in a way that it's kind of seen as the boxing capital. You know, if you want to become one of the best in boxing, America is the place to be. The atmosphere out there, the fighting atmosphere is slightly different. It's more relaxed. It's more laid back. Um, Whereas in the UK it's a little bit more tensed and fiery. Um, but I've boxed in America twice before. I've had successful fights twice in the past and it's, I love it. I love fighting in America. It's it's a great experience. I'm looking I'm looking forward to going back and I uh, I can't wait for two weeks time. What makes Fon Fari different maybe than other boxers you faced? Fon Fari he stands out because of his, his his recent performances. He's he's come off a good win against Chavez Jr. He's had a few good wins before that on the world stage. He's strong. He's tough. He can punch. He's got a good KO record. Um, and he's hungry. You know, he's got plenty of fire in his belly. And he comes to fight. You know, he, he's not one of these back foot boxers who plays safe. He comes, he stands, he lets his hands go. He's a good fighter. He's a good fighter. He's um, he's, he's, he's quite young as well. He's 27, I'm 28, so you could, you could say we're both pretty much in our primes. And uh, probably going to be peak performances. How are you finding in the second fight? How are you finding the sort of weight back to your weight to where you were? Yeah, it's, it's enjoyable actually. You know, I, I, I'm back at light heavyweight. I had a stint at cruiserweight, which was an enjoyable experience. Um, enjoyed the process, the weight training, the different aspects of training. Um, it was challenging, very difficult to, to maintain that weight, but it was a process I enjoyed, no regrets. But here we are back at my, my proper weight, light heavyweight. Um, where I belong, I feel natural at this weight. I feel sharp, energetic, um, and, and ready to, to to win titles again at this weight. So I'm back here to, to pick up pick up some belts. You looking sharp, Dan? Is that fair to say? Is he looking sharp? Yeah, he is. Yeah. <laughs> What's the training been like? You know, with the last. Uh... Since May, since the last well, fight. Um, just kept it rolling from our reunion yeah. because he, the cruiser week was November, and so yeah. um, went back with February, like January, February time. Um, just went back with his old root tree, just one of Wayne's Commonwealth, British, European, and world champion, just went back to the roots. Um, obviously, it only lasted 14 seconds the last fight, just kept it rolling from there and just see the progress. Throughout, throughout the weeks, throughout every session, he's progressing. And he's where he's at, where he wants to be, where he's already for, for two weeks time. Yeah, I mean, that, that fight only lasted 14 seconds, and it's been it had been 11 months since you've gone 12 rounds. How will the fitness be to you then? Um, I think it's all in the preparation now. You know, I've got from the past in the fights, I've got a lot of rounds under my belt, a lot of experience. The last fight. As you say, went 14 seconds. Um, you could say it's not ideal preparation going into a big tough fight against Von Farah, which is likely to go the distance. Um, but again, it's a it's a good confidence booster and 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 uh, just 
good to feel great back at light heavyweight. So I take it, you know, I'm taking that fight, that 14 second fight, as a positive, and uh, letting it fire me, fire me, and, and, and spur me on to to the front fire fight. Where are you, Jonathan? I mean, you've had some highs, you've had a couple of losses. Now, where do you feel you are now in your, your sort of career now as you try to aim to get back to become world champion? I feel at the more mature level in my career. I feel as though I'm at that stage where I've, I've matured as a person and as a fighter, really. Um, so I, I believe the, the, uh, the, the food the losses that I suffered in the last few years to defeat, I think they've helped me grow as a fighter and as a person. So, you know, the little bit of adversity, I think it's, um, it's allowing me to grow. So, come back stronger from this. I feel, I feel stronger mentally and physically. Um, I just feel, I feel m m much better for it. You know, I feel um, more, Humble as such, you know, it humbles you a little bit because with continued success and the hype, you can get carried away. I, I, I just feel as though it's helped me as a person, kept me humble, kept my feet on the ground, and, and got me back to to basics, working hard and, and uh, you know being around true people. Sort of back to America, sort of Welsh invasion. Will Lee Selby fighting in the same week, or it'd be a different place? Just you know, just a, another Welsh fighter who's gone out there to try and uh, conquer America. Yeah, it's a it's a good week for Welsh yeah. boxing. You know, two two guys from a small country in Wales, and we we flying the flag in America on a big stage. So obviously Lee's defending his world title. Um, he's looking good. You know, he's he's looking good at the moment. Looking to break through. And then myself, the, the same week, two days later, looking to make a big statement in, in, in America, in the boxing world. So, massive opportunity for two, two Welsh dragons. Finish your prediction? I predict two Welsh wins, actually. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I, 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 think, I think Lee defends his title, and I think, I think I can be successful in, in this fun far fight. It's going to be tough at times, maybe a few tricky moments in the fight. But overall, I think I'll have too many assets for this guy, and I think I can put on a good show. Point? On point? I think it's going to be a distance fight, yes. I think it's going to be a lot of runs in the band. Um, is it going to be points? Late stop is your point. That's what I can feel.